Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, everybody. Happy Monday. Let's see. Good morning, Vicki. Thank you for joining us. Good morning, Tina. Hi, Julie. Good morning, Carla. Good morning, Amber. Hi, Susie. All right, we're going to give everybody just a second to join. Um, while we wait, uh, let's see. Today we're going to be talking about the next step for these Master Plan Mondays. We're, we're ready for more. Um, if you're new, I'm Jane. I'm the CEO and founder of janesagenda.com. For the last decade, we've been helping women build planners that actually work. And now we have some male customers too, so that's exciting. Um, and for the last, I don't know, 20 years, I have been a, an expert in productivity and efficiency, and I've worked in operations and administration and things of that sort. And so some of the things that we're going to be talking about deal with stuff that I've had personal experience with, either in um, my pre-Jane's Agenda life or my Jane's Agenda life. And so welcome. If you're new, please make sure you hit that like button. Make sure that you subscribe and tap the bell. Um, we do a lot of training here at Jane's Agenda because I think everybody should be um, their most effective and have a planner that actually works. Um, so good morning. Good morning, Safona. See, lots of people joining us. All right, wonderful. Um, thank you. If it's early for you, thank you for waking up early for me. Um, let's see. Good morning, Tiffany. All right. Um, so we've been doing these um, Master Plan Mondays now for several months. I don't even remember when we started. It's been a while now. Um, and uh, we've been talking about productivity, um, strategic planning, how to be more effective. Um, and every Monday, I come up with a topic that I think that will speak to the community. And we cover that topic. And then I kind of send you off to fend for yourselves. Um, and I think we're ready for more than that. I think we're ready for more structure. And um, so I've put a lot of thought into this. Uh, I'm sure you saw some of my Facebook group posts a while back about um, what we need from training, things like that. And so I'm ready to roll out the next step. Very exciting. Um, so uh, why are we changing? Um, every week we learn more to be more effective, right? We're, we're not just talking about our planners. We're trying to be more effective in our lives. Um, and every week I'm watching all of your stories come through. Everybody posts pretty regularly in the Facebook group. I get to see that you are um, being more successful in your days. Um, I'm hearing that you have planners that actually work now, and that's exciting. Um, there's also challenges that people post, and we're able to work through those together. Um, but one of the consistent things that I hear um, in your feedback is that you want more structure, more depth, more, um, more, more in general. You want a clear path to follow. Um, you want a roadmap that starts from um, Hot Mess Express and takes you to Planner Expert. Um, I see a lot of people post that they are um, they're binge watching these lives, uh, all of our trainings, um, and that also confirms um, kind of the same thing within the feedback: is that you want more, more structure, more learning. And so I've put a lot of thought into this, and I've come up with um, with a plan for you. I'm a planner, right? So. Um, in response to your kind of shared aspiration, I'm excited to announce our next step uh, for Master Plan Monday. Um, I'm going to be calling it Master Plan 365 because I want it to be um, a year-long free course. We're going to be um, still here live. I'm going to go over all the details. Uh, it's a course designed to take you from where you are to where you hope to be in your planning journey. Um, we're going to do it together one step at a time. Um, and so uh, I'm excited. I'm excited that this is going to look a little different. I have some changes in, in mind. Um, uh, I have some things that are going to make this um, stick better. It doesn't do any good if I just talk at you through the screen if the lessons aren't something that you can apply in your real life. Um, so uh, let's see. Um, we've got some comments before I move on. <laughs> Definitely need a road map with eight kids. Ooh, I bet you do, ma'am. Ooh, you are my hero, Tiffany. Yes, currently rocking on this express, but desperately want to follow a road map for a better plan, more productive me. That's the goal. We've got some, we've got some big plans here. Um, 
I'm loving my planner, have not even thought of changing, and we're going into Q2. That's the goal, right? The goal is to get a planner that works. Um, part of what I realize, and I see this a lot, especially with the newer customers, is if you don't, um, it doesn't matter how beautiful and how effective I design the planners, uh, the planner pieces for you, um, if you don't know how to use them effectively, we're missing the mark. And so that's what these trainings are gonna be helping get there. So, um, hot, hot, hotness for sure. I bet you are hot, Shannon. Um, I know you mean hot mess, but that's okay. Uh, all right, so hopefully this is kind of resonating with some of you, most of you. Um, uh, yeah, I was right. All right, um, so we're going to be calling it Master Plan 365. It is a year-long course. Now, I've designed literally the entire thing. I have, I have um, a training plan for each week. I have a topic for each month. Um, so who is this going to be for? Who's going to really like this level of training and what we're going to be doing? Um, a seasoned professional looking for um, streamlining your workflow, um, a student aiming for academic success, anyone kind of in between seeking personal growth. Uh, it's kind of the next step. Um, anyone who wants to be more effective in their daily lives, more productive, and anyone who believes that a paper planner is a good tool to kind of go along with that. Um, this is somebody who, who would enjoy this training that we're going to be doing. Um, some of it, I will say, is going to cover topics we've already touched on before, but in different ways. We're going to really make sure that it sticks this time and that you are able to effectively put that training into your lives. Um, I also want this to be a community journey a little more than it's been. Uh, I don't want it to be a solo journey. I don't want you to feel like I, I throw the information at you and you're left alone to fend with it. Um, and so we're going to be doing stuff that's more collaborative with you. Um, we're going to be involving the Facebook group a lot more. Um, I believe that with the right habits and the right training and the right community, we can do anything we want to um, and we can achieve anything. And so that's kind of the goal going forward. All right, so um, what to expect, right? We have, um, we've been doing this every week. And so if you've been here for a little bit, I know some, some of you were fairly new, um, we're still gonna be meeting every Monday. Um, but the difference, <laughs> love group support, thank you, Tina. Um, is we're going to have a monthly theme, some um, larger over over uh, topic that covers each month. So we've got 12 different topics to cover for the next year. Um, and then I'm going to break those bigger topics into smaller weekly lessons that help kind of digest that information. Um, we're going to cover everything from how to form habits to how to master digital tools. Um, I have so much. We've got uh, information on... Um, like emotional intelligence and, and all sorts of things to make you more effective, just well-rounded. Um, it's not all gonna be about planners, but we are gonna always have, um, have our planners there as a tool to help us be successful. Um, so we're gonna deep dive every week into these smaller, actionable um, mini topics that go up to the bigger topic each month. Every month we're gonna cover a new bigger theme. Um, we're going to have a, theor a blend of theory, practical uh, application, real life case studies, um, and they're going to be all structured and scheduled. You're going to know exactly what we're covering each week. Um, no questions ahead of time. I'm going to make sure that we have um, we have a calendar that you can add to your Google calendar or your iCal. You're going to be able to know exactly what you're going to be learning and what's going to be necessary. What's nice about that is that if you if we touch on a topic that you have zero interest in, you'll know you can skip that week. Um, now, of course, there's going to be weeks where you choose to skip it and then change your mind and you can still join us. Um, there's going to be uh, so much transparency around what you're going to be learning. Um, and I think that's going to be really nice. We're going to have what I'm going to call book club with this um, reading assignments, books that I recommend that if you're a reader, you can read um, for the month. So a different book every month that kind of coincides with whatever the main theme is. Um, I'm a reader, I read a ton, and um, I'm gonna make sure that the book is something that um, I highly recommend and um, helps make sure the, the training is more, um, more digested. Um, and so we're gonna do that. Uh, let's see. My brain operates on step one, step two with ADHD. I'm already all over the place. Well, you're going to like the structure then because it's going to help a lot, I think. Um, Amber, yes. Gina says, so exciting. All right, good morning. 
Okay, so um, we're gonna have book club. I'm gonna have a reading um, a reading list of uh, books that we're gonna cover. We're gonna read them together. Um, I'm excited about that. Some of the books I've read before, but I'm gonna read them again with you. Um, and some books are books I haven't read yet that I, I want to read because they have been highly recommended to me by um, experts in these fields. Um, let's see, we've got questions. Uh, Everything is going to be um, available afterwards, Carla. These are all going to be live, just like we're live now. You can go back on. You'll be able to go back on our YouTube. We're going to have um, a centralized uh, resource area. I'm going to call it right now the resource repository because it's fancy. Um, I'm going to call it our centralized information hub. So you can go back anytime and rewatch videos um, and participate that way. No problems. Uh, let's see. Would you put the book for everyone to read if they're even if they're not? Absolutely. Um, I'm going to I'm going to be putting out the book list um, for everybody. So no problem. Been waiting for book club. Wonderful. This is awesome. Y'all hit the like button to help out Jane she, for all she does for us. Thank you so much. All right. So um, I love to read. And so if you don't like to read, you don't have to. Um, not everybody's a reader. And I'm going to give you the links to find the exact book, the one that I'm going to be reading with you. Um, if you want to listen to the audible version, if you want to read Kindle or the paperback or the hardcover, whatever, you're going to have that opportunity to do whatever you want. This is entirely optional, but it's definitely a way that we're going to layer in these trainings. Um, so that's the first part. Um, I'm going to create a centralized information hub on our website where all of this data is going to be stored for you later. So let's say someone joins three months in, they can still go back and participate um, like they were starting from the beginning. Um, I want to have all of this information available for you because I think that it's a way that we can all level up together. I'm very excited about this. Um, I'd also like to gauge your interest in a virtual study hall. This would be um, Zooms where you can all interact with each other. We're very much um, a one-sided training when I do these lives. I see some comments, right? But um, we can't really interact with each other. And so I was thinking maybe like a monthly virtual study hall where everybody can come and we can discuss the learning. We can talk about the book. Um, you can ask questions if there's things that you didn't understand and we can all work together. Um, so if you think that would be interesting, I'm totally down to schedule those monthly as well to go with the themes of the month. Um, and like I said, I'm calling that a, a virtual study hall. Um, so if you want to do that, we'll do that too, because I think that would be amazing. And then um, ideally, those are something that also live so that if you couldn't join the virtual study hall, you could go watch it later and participate on your own time. Um, I think I think a Zoom is a, is a necessary part for us to really digest this information. I think we can... Um, we can learn a lot from each other and I would love to see your faces and hear your voices because I, I think that that would be so enjoyable. Um, we are an e-commerce business and so we are entirely online and I don't get to see customers in person most of the time. So this would be really fun for me as well. Um, let's see, we've got a lot more comments coming through. All right, <laughs> book club and planning 2024 is gonna rock. I think you're gonna enjoy it. I've got a lot of structure planned, um, Gina. Love that. Tiffany, yes, virtual study hall. Okay, so we will add that to the plan. We got a lot of people coming through with yes. Um, wonderful, okay. All right, yes to all the things. Okay, wonderful. All right, so that's what we're gonna do. Um, every week, I'm gonna give you homework. Now this isn't gonna be like 35 hours of homework. We're gonna talk about real quick, easy things that you can do to make sure that you've applied the lesson. Um, we're gonna do this so that it's uh, in your planner. Um, they're going to be things that help bridge the gap between learning and doing. Um, and I'm also going to be rolling out new uh, monthly workbook inserts to go, go inside, coincide with the training. Um, these are going to be available to purchase. Now, these are not, um, these are not something you're going to get for free because there's going to be a lot of work my team is going to put into these monthly, um, monthly inserts. Uh, now the training is free. The weekly training is free, and I'm going to give you the book list and all the things. Um, you can totally participate in the uh, study hall for free, all of those things. Um, but as far as the team putting together the inserts that I, I want to do, those are going to be something that I have to charge for in order to do it properly. Um, and so um, hopefully I made that clear. The, the training is free, but the extra 
inserts are not going to be. The workbook inserts are for those that want to dive deeper into the training, that you really want to um, get the most out of it. They're going to be packed with resources, uh, my personal notes, reading guides, templates, um, exclusive exercises. I see a lot of people right now in the, um, in the Facebook group asking how they take notes for these trainings. And so I'm going to give you a tool that's designed to work right with our trainings, because I already know what we're going to talk about. I can design an insert that works um, perfectly with the way that we're going to be learning. Um, you're welcome, Safana. Tina says, yes, Zoom. Wonderful. OK, I need a, a section for training. This is awesome. OK, great. I'm getting a lot of good feedback. OK, um, so um, I'm going to cover that, too. All right, so um, they're going to be available in printable and printed version. These are something that you can download immediately and do it yourself. You're going to need a printer to do that. You're going to need all the paper and all the things. But if you don't want to wait, I'm going to make that an option. It's also going to be slightly more affordable because they don't have any extra costs past the design. Um, but we're also going to make them available in a printed version that we will print in your planner size and ship to you. And every month, um, I'm going to be rolling these out. These are going to be available from mini to letter. All of our standard planner sizes are going to be available in. Um, in these workbook inserts. Um, and um, we're gonna make sure that these are designed to work hand in hand with the training and they're gonna be completely different every month. There's gonna be some things like the notes and stuff that are probably gonna roll over, but I am going to literally sit down and design an insert every month specifically to work within our training. Um, I think it's necessary because I want you to have the tools to be successful. And what's going to be really nice is if you participate, you know, pretty consistently in the inserts, eventually you're going to have this little book of productivity. I think that's going to be amazing. Um, all you're going to need probably for um, putting these in your planner is just a section dedicated to them. So don't overthink it. Um, I'm going to do all the thinking for you. And then I will teach you how to use the inserts as well so that you will be as effective as possible. Um, they're going to be organized and designed to work within the topic of the month. Um, I think that's a good way for us to make sure that you have everything you need. And in there is going to be, um, you know, like the supply list, which is usually going to be just the book and maybe some colored pens. I'm not going to make it ridiculous. Um, and so um, hopefully all of this is speaking to you so far. I do have a little bit more to tell you today. So uh, let's see. Make sure I answer your questions as I go. Otherwise, I will never be able to go back all the way up. All right. Wonderful. Thank you for joining us, Alba. Um, I think our planner dreams are coming true. Uh, OK, I think we're talking about the pricing. I have to charge something for that. I'm going to put a lot of work into it. Um, this is not something that I would charge if I didn't have to. Um, but uh, we're going to we're going to put a lot of work into it. You're going to really like these inserts and they're going to be designed um, to work very well with the training. Um, now, I'm sure you could use these inserts the way that I'm designing them. I'm sure you could use them for other personal uh, development goals, but I do want to specify that they are going to be designed to work with our training. So um, as far as using them for other um, learning, that might be hit or miss. And I want to cover that, that these are specifically designed for working within the James Agenda training modules. OK, um, a monthly workbook subscription. I'll have to look into that. And that way you don't have to worry about it. It just gets charged monthly. That's not a bad idea, Tina. Another reason to buy new discs and a cover. Okay. Um, I am going to design them in small chunks so that if you want to just be able to add this small packet to your planner, it doesn't take up a bunch of room. But if you want to store them over the whole year, you may want a whole separate planner for that. Um, I'll let you guys decide that. We got another request for auto ship subscription. Okay, I will look into that this week and see if we can't roll something out like that as an option. I don't want these to be required to be subscription though. Um, I want them to be optional so that if there's a topic for the month you don't want to participate in, um, if that consistently happens for someone, they have the option to only participate in the ones they want to. I think for most people, they're going to want to participate in every month because I, I personally would when I looked at these topics um, that, that I've picked. Um, my type A brain is very excited by all this. Wonderful. Um, so I don't want to include them in the regular subscription because they're not going to co coincide with the theme of the subscription typically. And not everybody is going to um, want to participate in the training. And um, so this would be a separate 
thing. Um, ideally, this would be something you could get a digital subscription instead of a printed if you really wanted to. Um, I am hoping to make them affordable. Now, we may be able to combine them with your subscription so that you save on the shipping costs. I don't know yet. I have to look at it. Um, but they would still have to be a separate subscription, if that makes sense. I wouldn't be able to automatically include these every month for subscribers. Um, there's just no way um, that we could do that. But I do. I will look into seeing if we can combine them so that they ship at the same time and you save the shipping cost. Um, maybe as an add-on. I'll, I'll have to look into that, Betty. Um, thank you so much for all the work you that you put in to educate us and help us make our planners work for us. You're such a blessing. Oh, you're wonderful, Kelly. Thank you so much. Um, sorry, it takes me a while to read the comments. It pops up real tiny on my screen. Um, Will the extra inserts be individual or in a subscription? So I, I hadn't really thought about putting it in a subscription, but now we've had a few requests. Um, so the inserts will be available separately. And if I can swing a subscription, we can make that as an option. That way you don't have to worry about going and buying them every month. You can just you know set and forget, and then you're already set up for the month. Um, this wouldn't be a ton each month. So it would just be something that gets tossed in a flat mailer and sent to you. And so I'm sure my team could handle that um all right we got i like that idea some more subscriptions okay a printable version is perfect for international customers exactly um, and that's why i want to be able to make it available um, that way for you all right just another reason for just another planner okay um can we possibly do this as a bundle with disc cover if we want a separate planner for these trainings um that's so Miranda, uh, the way that our website is uh, structured, there's something like 2 million different options that you can have between discs and covers and sizes. Um, and I'm not even exaggerating, like we're talking about like 2 million. It's a lot. And so whenever we tried to make like um, a bundled planner, it gets real uh, overwhelming for our website. Um, I can't seem to pull that all. So unfortunately, as far as being able to do that, um, I don't think so, but we do have covers, I believe, covers and discs in our last chance section right now. So if uh, financially this is something that you need to consider, the last chance section might still have some stuff in there that's marked down significantly. All right, Tina's got lots of possibilities. All right, um, so, uh, okay, would there be a digital subscription as well? Yes. Um, ideally, if we do a subscription, we would have both available. So you could have um, either a printable or a physical or both um, subscription. I like the idea of people being able to choose what they want. So I'll look into that this week. I don't know exactly if we'll be able to roll that out initially. It might take a little bit more time because that sounds like a little bit more structure for my team to have to set up. Um, but I will get you answers. All right. Um, so let's see. Make sure that I've covered everything on my notes here. I have four pages of notes to cover with you because I want to make sure um, we're set up for success. So um, how to make the most out of this future training, um, this master plan 365, uh, it's going to come down to engagement. You're going to get out of it what you put into it. You can, um, you can do as little or as much as you want each week. Um, I'm going to give you plenty of lesson, plenty of homework, plenty of notes, things that you need to be able to be effective within the training topic each week. Um, but that's going to kind of fall on to you as far as how effective you want to be. Um, I recommend you attend the sessions each week, either live, um, preferably live, because we like to interact, um, or on replay. Um, that's fine, but you'll want to you'll want to participate every week. Um, I also want you to interact with um, the other people that have participated, because I think you're going to get to learn a lot from each other. There's going to be um, engagement homework as far as like what to talk about to start these conversations with each other so that you can learn. Um, we're going to have a breakout chat in the Facebook group. So there's going to be a designated place for these conversations every week. Um, you're going to want to read the books. Um, now, I don't make any money off of recommending these books. These are going to be things that I just think um, go well with the training. I'll give you links um, where I find them easiest or cheapest or whatever. Um, but those are those are optional. Those are things that I'm going to read with you because they coincide with our theme. Um, I recommend you use the inserts, but they are optional. Mm -hmm. But based on how the training is going to go, it's going to give you the structure you need to thoroughly put in place. Um, you're going to want to do the homework each week. Now, these are going to be small. 
Um, they're really tiny action steps. Um, I have homework for you for this week and it's only 30 minutes is how long I expect it to take you. So don't think it's gonna take a ton of time, but um, as far as if you put that homework into place, you're gonna start immediately seeing a benefit in your daily life. We're gonna see more, um, more productivity, more efficiency, our time management's gonna get better. Um, and all of that's gonna relate to less stress and more peace. And isn't that what we are all, all looking for, right? I could use more of it. So um, that's what I'm going to expect as far as um, what we'll take to get the most out of this is to do those things. Now, I'm only doing one book a month. Uh, for some people, that's going to feel like a lot. For me, um, that's that's not. I, I read two, three books a week. And so it's just going to work in. But I'm trying to keep it in um, uh, what we'll call it bite sized chunks. So there's only going to be 12 books. If you guys start feeling like you need more resources, I can always recommend like extra credit books, but there's only going to be one main book that we cover each week or each um, month for a book club. Um, so as far as like expectations um, that I have, I want you to, if you're going to be participating, um, I'd like you to commit to trying. Um, now, if, if you find that it, the training is not effective for you for whatever reason, that's fine. But I want you to give it a solid try each week because these. Um, if you only do it halfway, we're only going to see half results. And I don't think that's um, doing anybody any justice. Um, let's see. We've got comments. Oh, my. Let's see. Okay. Sorry. There were a lot. Uh, thank you for making it a free training. Yes, 100%. I think everybody should be able to afford to be effective and productive. Um, maybe you should make a little moolah on the book. <laughs> I, I don't even know if I have time to figure out how to do that, Gina. I am an analog girl. I love my paper and technology sometimes fights me. You guys have seen what it's like when I try to do the lives and everything gets blurry and how frustrated I get. So if, if I can figure out a way to do that so that the team gets a little bit more and it doesn't cost you anything, then I'll look into it. But right now I'm super, it's not important to me. I want you to be effective is my main goal. Yes to more peace. Okay. There's a lot of people saying that I should do that. I'm sure Tina could probably walk me how, through how to do that. I bet you have one. Um, I'm gonna have to look into it. I don't know how to. I don't know how to do that off the top of my head. I've never tried. Um, all right. And Tiffany says she's fully committed to trying, and so very excited. Okay. An Amazon store. I guess that's a well, and that might make it easy. Um, I think that might make it easier for you guys to find the books too. I guess um, I'll have to look into that. So now I've got more notes. See so you. I love it. You guys give me homework too. So we're gonna look into a subscription option. Um, and an Amazon store, apparently. All right. Uh, and you are wonderful, Eva, Eva Lee. Um, all right. So uh, expectations, we're going to commit. We're going to push some boundaries. Some of the things I'm going to be working on with you um, have to deal with self-care and um, mindset. They're not all going to be um, very uh, structured. That way, some of these things are going to take some personal growth. I'm very excited about that. Um, but I want you to feel comfortable pushing some of your boundaries because um, I know with me, sometimes I fight change. And once I've tried it and I've actually done the thing, I'm super thankful that I did it. And I wish I hadn't fought it so long. And so I hope that doesn't happen to you. So um, I want you to already be comfortable that we're going to push some boundaries this year and we're going to be our most effective best selves. Um, good morning, Debbie. Welcome. All right. Uh, let's see. I want you to be open to changes. Ch things are going to change. Um, but it's all for a good cause. It's to um, live our best lives. Um, we're going to be transforming our actions, but we're going to be also transforming our mindsets as we go. Um, I have to fight change. So we're going to just pep talk ourselves, Carla, um, knowing that the change is for a good reason. We're going to do it anyway. All right. Um, so if there's any other questions before we move on, um, I do have a homework assignment for you, um, but I'm going to give you a second to kind of give me any of your questions. I'd love to hear from you. Um, if you have any thoughts um, or concerns about Master Plan 365, uh, what excites you most about this? Um, things like that. Um, <laughs> I love it. I'm committed to whatever it is. <laughs> Um, we're going to have fun. We're going to learn. Um, I know somebody asked, when is this all going to start? So officially, um, officially this is going to start April 1st. Um, I believe that's the Monday. Yes, April 1st. Um, but next week we are going to cover the how 
this is all going to work and, and give you the training it takes to get started in this course. Um, I want you to understand everything you need to know. Um, on Thursday, I plan to roll out the first set of inserts. Um, I'm going to... Um, I'm going to be emailing everybody. If you're not on our email list, make sure you're on our email list because that's where we'll be staying in contact. I am going to create a separate email list that we can join later so that um, if you want more information about this weekly, we can do that too. Um, but for right now, if you want to join our email list, it's janesagenda.com slash list, or you can enter your email on literally any form on our website and it'll go there. And I'll be rolling out an email with more details this Thursday. Um, and I will be talking about it in our live uh, at 1 p.m. Right now we're on the same time as PST, Pacific, as Pacific time, um, California time, because Arizona decides to do whatever it wants. Um, all right, we've got more comments here. I definitely hate change. My word of the year is intentional. So hopefully this gets me on the right track. Thank you for all you do. Uh, I so need this right now. I have so many things going on. I will commit to trying. Give it a try. That's all I ask. I'm okay with change. I just need someone to hold me accountable. See, and that's what we need. That's why um, the current structure of our previous our previous structure doesn't work for some people because I'm kind of just setting you free and hoping for the best. Um, and so um, we are, we're gonna do this together, but there's gonna be contact throughout the week. It's not just gonna be on Monday. This is gonna be an ongoing all the time thing um, where you can, like I said, participate as much or as little as you want. I'm very excited about it. Um, I do have um, your first start of homework for you um, for this week. Um, and so um, we're we're going to dive into that. I really need to finish unpacking my office and get all the books on the shelf so I can see if I have any of these books before I buy again. Yeah. So and like I said, some of these books I've read before, but maybe it's been a couple of years. And so in context of our training, I will even be reading them again with you. I will be doing it right there side by side so that I can discuss them live with you if you have questions um, and I'm fully like refreshed. Um, Safona, are we starting now? I really hope so. Um, so technically speaking, yes, we are starting now. Um, but as far as the formal training, um, that will start on the 1st of April so that we have time to prepare. Um, people can get the inserts in the mail, um, things like that. Uh, <laughs> yep, Emily, you're gonna wanna go back and watch. I, uh, it's a pretty big announcement. Um, all right. Working together makes me more accountable because I don't want to feel behind because I didn't do what we needed to do. Um, I feel the same way. So I don't, if I have committed to someone, I won't let them down. Um, but if it's just me for some reason, I'm okay with that. Not healthy. I realize that. But like, for instance, um, Amanda, who you've seen on our lives before, she and I will frequently go for walks. And if we schedule a time to meet, I will go work out with her and I will do that thing. But if I end up scheduling myself just to go work out, um, I may or may not cancel on myself. Um, and so this will help with that. If that's a problem you face regularly, you're going to be, um, you're gonna be enjoying this process. I'm excited because I'm lost. I only use monthly and I need more structure. Yes, so we're gonna be not only learning how to plan more effectively, um, we're gonna be learning how to be more effective and then use our planners as the tool that they are. So it's gonna be very multifaceted. Um, what will be the time? So we're going to continue to do our, our trainings on Mondays, the same way we're doing because it works really well for my schedule and everybody's used to it. Um, so right now we are 8 a.m. Uh, Pacific on Mondays, um, but that also gives you the whole week to watch the replay if you can't make it. Um, and then um, I'm going to be trying to roll out, um, we're a little late this month, I realize, because um, I decided over the weekend to, to finally um, pull the trigger on this this journey. Um, but I'm going to try to get new inserts up by the 15th every month for the next month. So that gives you a couple weeks to receive them um, before you need them the same way our subscription ships in the middle of the month. Um, this will be a good thing. I think so. I think you're going to really enjoy it. And it's way more structure. Um, like I said, some of the topics we've touched on before, but if they weren't um, thoroughly integrated into your life, I think that you're going to want to do them again. And so some of it will feel like we're starting from scratch. That's all right. This is a year long journey we're going to do together. All right. So homework right for this week. Um, I expect to take about 30 minutes. I want you to spend some time um, doing some self reflection um, about your productivity habits, your challenges, um, your successes. And we're going to set clear personalized goals 
for the next year. Um, so I want you to do a personal productivity audit. If you've never done one of these before, don't worry, it's not that um, intensive. Um, you're gonna spend 30 minutes thinking about your current planning um, and your productivity habits. And you're going to consider what methods have been effective for you and which ones have not before. Um, I want you to think about any challenges that you've had in uh, staying organized, um, managing your time, achieving, uh, achieving your goals. And um, I want you to ask, ask yourself some questions and you can do this all on a note page because I realize you don't have a tool right now for this. Just um, any note page, just write it down. I want you to think about what planning tools or systems are you currently using, just list them out. Um, paper planners, digital apps, list out all the apps, list out um, what you're doing. Um, maybe you're using a combination of both. I want you to write it all out. Um, and then I want you to look at it and think about what are your biggest productivity challenges? Um, do you have trouble with time management, prioritization? Do you have trouble maintaining focus? Um, is it execution, actually getting the tasks done? Um, I know that um, planners love to plan, but that doesn't mean we get it done, right? So think about these things. What are your biggest productivity challenges? And then I want you to um, identify any habits that you think might boost your productivity. And are there habits that are distracting from it? Um, again, don't spend a lot of time on this. It doesn't have to be perfect. It's just to get our wheels turning and to start thinking about this. Um, if you don't know where you're going, how do you know if you got there is the concept. Um, and then I want you to start setting goals. So based on your audit, you're going to look at how productive you are. We're going to look at what tools we're using, um, what your biggest challenges are, and we're going to look at our habits. And then we're going to set two to three goals, just real small, um, two to three goals that you want to achieve over the next year participating in this Master Plan 365. Um, I want these goals to be smart, right? So specific, measurable, actionable, relevant, and time-bound. And we are going to cover SMART. If you're not familiar, SMART is one of the modules we're going to cover um, later on. So don't worry about that. Just make sure that the goals are something that you actually feel like you can achieve. Um, and so two to three goals. Um, things that you could think about to set your goals. Um, what specific productivity improvements or skills do I want to develop? You could think like, I want to master time, uh, time blocking. I want to be effective with my task prioritization. Um, how will I measure my progress towards these goals? Uh, how will you know if you've achieved it? Goals, um, goals said in the abstract mean nothing, right? So what will that look like for you? Think about what done looks like. Um, if you are ta mastering time blocking, what does that look like for you? How does that feel? What is the days? What, what do the days look like? Um, let's see. Uh, and then think about what makes these goals relevant for your personal or professional growth? How will they improve your life? Um, and then let's see, oh, we've got more comments. 100%, you don't have to buy the book if you have a library near you that um, offers it. And these are very popular books, so um, they've been around a little while and hopefully they will be in your library. Um, good point. Okay, I'm hyped. I was really successful with Fly Lady. I love Fly Lady. Um, Yes, structure me, please. <laughs> Wonderful. All right. Um, so uh, we're going to um, we're going to set a couple goals for the next year, and we're going to do a, uh, uh, a productivity audit. Um, and then I want you to think about one or two steps that you can ensure you're ready to engage with this master plan 365. That could be um, setting an alarm, writing it in your planner. Um, something like that. Um, I think that um, setting up a couple steps that you want to take to making sure that you're going to be effective is a good way to start. It's all about mindset. Like I said, if we don't make it an, uh, if we don't make it a priority, it's not going to happen. Um, and then I'm going to post in the Facebook group and ask for some of your findings. Again, we're holding each other accountable. So look for that. I'm going to go post after we're done here today um, and um, give you that opportunity to share your findings from your productivity audit, from your planning audit, um, and I'll post this in there too. So you can get a list of what we're looking for. Um, I realize I talk fast and you're probably scrambling to take notes. So I'm gonna put that in the Facebook group post. If you're not in the Facebook group, make sure you join. We're gonna do a lot of work in there. Um, it's janesagenda.com slash group. 
um, which is just a quick link to redirect you to the Facebook group. Um, come and join and um, participate with us. All right, so um, we've got one question here. Where did it go? Um, will we get a list of books from the start? So I can give you the list for the entire year if you'd like. Um, my only hesitation there, Kimberly, is if you participate ahead, will it be fresh when we go to use it? So I guess that's um, that's my only challenge. I thought about giving like maybe the next quarter. That way, if you want to read ahead, you're not too far out. Um, but I really think it will be more useful if you read them real time. So that's up to you. Um, uh, I know I like to I like to be prepared, and so I've already ordered the first quarter of physical books to read with you. I have a lot of them already on uh, Audible and stuff like that, but I want to have the physical book for taking notes. Um, and so I totally respect that. But I do think it would be more, um, <laughs> I'm scrambling. <laughs> I do think it would be more effective to read the book in real time with us um, for the month. All right. Um, so Thursday, we're going to talk about this some more um, on the weekly plan and peak, um, which is at 1 p.m. Pacific time. Um, and I'm going to be giving you the uh, first sneak peeks of May, the May subscription box will cover a little bit more of this. I'm also going to be sending out an email on Thursday with a bunch of details. So again, if you're not on the email list, go join janesagenda.com slash list or any email field on our website. And I will make sure that you get all of this information um, again um, and any new information that we've developed throughout the week. Again, this is new, um, but I'm putting a lot of effort into this because I think you, um, I think you deserve it and I think you're ready for it. Um, and then next Monday, so on, today is March 18th, um, let's see, what's next Monday? So March 25th at 8 a.m. Pacific, we're going to be covering how to, um, how we're going to do this, what the structure looks like. Uh, I'll go over the inserts with you and how to use them, um, all of that. We're going to talk about the books and things that we're going to be learning. Um, I'll cover the topics for the year so you can see what's coming. I'll teach you how to set up everything you need to know. Um, I'm going to have uh, a calendar link so you can add this to your calendar, um, all the things. Um, and that'll be next Monday because we're, we're out of time today. Um, and I'm going to have so much to show you. Mm, all right, we've got questions popping up real fast. Okay, I don't use Facebook or any social media other than YouTube. Will I still be able to keep caught up if a lot of the process will be done there. So the, think of the Facebook more like study hall. It's where people are gonna go to participate with each other. You, if you don't need um, that social um, interaction, the holding yourself accountable with others, then you won't need the Facebook um, Facebook group. Everything will be on our website. It will be sent by email. It will be here on YouTube um, when, I, when I go live. Um, so social media is not required. Um, it's just another layer that we're throwing in there for that um, social interaction. Um, I would love a list of books too, mainly to see when they are due because I source most of my books at thrift shops. Okay, so I can I can roll out the full book, book list. I think that's a great idea. Um, I didn't think about being able to thrift them. Wonderful idea. Okay. I feel like my year just took a turn in a direction I didn't even know that I needed and I cannot express how excited I am. Wonderful, Tiffany. Okay, good. I'm getting so much positive feedback. I'm always canceling on myself. You know, that part where the Grinch says it, I can't handle it. It's so much, it's so true. We need others. We need the accountability, I think. Okay, wonderful. Um, is the sub box going out soon? I believe uh, we're gonna start shipping here uh, after our morning meeting. Um, so yes, Nikki. Um, it is going out soon. The team is ready. The team is ready to ship it um, because of the way the weekend fell. It's always really hard when the weekend falls um, between the 15th and 18th because that's when we usually ship the box. Uh, and so the team is excited to get it out of here, get some free space. And uh, I know you're excited to get it. All right. Um, so let's make sure I covered everything. Uh, course officially starts April 1st. We're going to be preparing until then. Um, and then hopefully once you feel prepared, we don't have to do that every single month because you're already, already going to know what you're supposed to do. And it's just going to be small things uh, as stuff changes um, or updates. All right. Um, so thank you so much for joining me today. If you did not subscribe, make sure you hit the subscribe button on our YouTube. Make sure you tap the bell icon um, so you get notified because you're going to want to know when we go live like this. Um, make sure that you hit the like button 
button on this video. It helps us. It helps our small business. I really appreciate it. Um, and then I cannot wait to see what this year brings you. I really, I really can't. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. Um, it's the next level for us. And so you're going to start seeing that phrase, the master plan 365, and you're going to know that it's part of our new, our new structure and our new course. Um, and um, I'm calling it a productivity blueprint in my head because we're going to give you a blueprint for success. Um, I've been doing this a long time, and I'm really excited to roll all that knowledge out to you. Um, and we're going to do it together. So thank you so much for watching. I will see you, and um, we'll be in contact on Thursday. Um, so goodbye for now. Um, I hope you have an amazing week. Uh, don't forget to go to the Facebook group to look for that um, homework, homework post. And um, that's all. Have a great day. Bye, everybody.